Hello guys, I am back. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. There must be something bad to feed. I literally have been gone for a hot minute, but I'm back and I'm better and I am so excited because I have a ton of new content lined up for you guys and we're starting off just right with a little pretty little thing haul. So if you guys follow me on Instagram, you would have known that I was away in Cleveland for an entire month. And while I was there, I decided to spice up my outfits a little bit and I ordered some stuff from Pretty Little Thing. So a lot of these outfits I've worn out already, but I haven't been able to sit down and show you guys them as yet. So that's what I'm here to do for you guys today. So guys, with that being said, we got a lot to catch up on. I got a lot of cute things to show y'all. So stay tuned and let's get into the video. Guys, Cleveland was such a wild experience. If you're following me on Instagram, you would have seen how crazy it was being there for an entire month, the group of people that I was with, the outfits I was popping off in, like it was a good time. And if you're not following me, guys, now is your time to do so because all my contents on Instagram. I post a ton of stories all the time. And that's where you get to see all the exciting things that I do throughout my day. So definitely follow me over there. Just a little self promo, like go, go. Go follow me. So let's break down the outfits and go through all the cute pieces. As I said earlier, majority of these outfits I wore already, so I'll have inserts of how I styled them, where I wore them, I'll have pictures of that here. So we're gonna slide on over to the right, to the right, and let's get into these outfits. Okay guys, so starting off with outfit number one, we have this two-piece set here that I wore to a Nelly concert during All-Star Weekend. I will insert some clips over here for you guys to see. This set was hot, 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 steaming hot. It's that pleather material, so let's break down the pants first and then we'll get into the top. So here it is. It is a beautiful chocolate brown color. It comes with a zipper on the back. And then on the sides, there's these cutouts throughout the sides. Only issue with it is that I felt like it gave me a little bit of a frumpy crotch. I really had to hike these pants all the way up to my to be able to make sure that I didn't look like I had a frumpy crotch. But other than that, it was super cute. These pants, because of the cutouts on the side, you would have to wear either a thong, maybe in a chocolate brown color, or you have to go commando. Whatever flows to your boat, you can do that. With that, it also came with this matching top. It does like a little crisscross tie-up moment in the front. The Itty Bitty Titty Committee, it just covers it completely. If you personally like a little bit of cleavage and you're in that Itty Bitty Titty Committee, you're not gonna get that much. Honestly, it's not happening, but it's still really cute on and the set together looks amazing. So this next piece, guys, what I say is fire, spicy, hot, hot, hot. I'm not kidding. So this is what I wore on actual All-Star Weekend or actual All-Star Weekend day, so the Sunday. Guys, this moment, this moment. When I say spicy, when I say hot, 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 I'm not kidding. I'm really, really not kidding with this outfit. So one thing to know, it is see-through. So if you're not about that see-through life, it's not for you, boo-boo. But when I say this looked so good, like so good on, I'm not even kidding. I got this in a size small. I wear size small for everything. So US size four, UK size eight. So that's all the outfits. Comfortable, you could dance, you can move, like there's no restriction. You look sexy, like you're going to look sexy no matter what. So next outfit, we have this cute little romper moment. Guys, I'm a little bit sad because it broke. I only wore it once and it broke already, but she's still sexy and I'm gonna show you. And I think I could fix it. I just need a little stitch of the top here. This is what it looks like. Again, this is another see-through moment, but the only difference is that this one actually comes with the built-in bottoms, so you don't have to worry about having your own pair of like black underwear or anything. It comes with the built-in bottoms that you can wear. In the back, I keep this not really doing it justice because right now it's broken, but it does this whole crisscross moment in the back. I have clips of it, so you'll be able to see what it looks like. Sexy, very sexy. All right, next on the list, let's move on to a dress. So I have this little black moment, <laughs> y'all. The first time I put this dress on, I'm gonna show you guys a clip. I did like an Instagram review of it with my friend. I'll, I'll insert it right here. 
I don't know what was going on. I really don't know what was going on. So this is what the dress looks like. Again, it's very hard to show you just like this. It just looks like a hot mess. It is a little bit of a hot mess on as well, but it's still really cute. It's cut out, cut out, cut out. I think the way that they laced it up was wrong. So I'm gonna try to relace it because when I put it on, y'all, no, <laughs> it was a no for me. I'm like, where am I wearing this? If I move in the wrong direction, it's gonna be like, hello, open sesame. Like it was, it's a lot. All right, so next on the list, we have this two piece moment. So it's this really pretty dress. This is giving like straight vacation vibes. Like I need to be on a beach. I need to be in Tulum. I need to be in Dominican, Jamaica, anywhere, but Canada right now, honestly, cause it's so cold. But this is giving straight beach vibes. I love this because it has this little cutout detailing in the front. And then what it also comes with is this top piece. So the top piece goes like right over the dress and then it gives you cutouts down the arm, which I think is so cute. It fits me like a glove, hugs me in all the right places. And we love that. So 10 out of 10 for this dress, very comfortable. I can dance, I can move, I don't feel restricted. I love it. Okay, the last two things that I'm gonna show y'all are the most complicated things to put on. I don't know why Pretty Little Thing did this with these two outfits. Y'all, when I say, when I first tried this on, I literally took like 20 minutes trying to figure them out. Like, I'm not even kidding. So the first one here, this one actually I got it in a size six, which is a UK size 10 because my size was actually sold out and I really wanted it. So this is what it looks like. It's just a really cute black dress and it does like this little crisscross here. You'll see it when it's on. It does a little crisscross across your stomach. Super cute on. The only thing about it, guys, is I'm telling you, it was mission impossible to get on. Like, we need a full-on tutorial on how to put on this dress because the crisscross in the front was just giving me anxiety. Other than that, really cute. Another thing with it, since it was a size bigger, it was a little bit more like frumpy in some areas, which I didn't really love because dresses like this, you want it to just feel snug. And because they didn't have my size and I really wanted it, I just said, forget it, we're gonna go for it anyway. So that's totally on me, but with this and the material and how stretchy it is, honestly, I would say stick to your size. If it's sold out, just don't get it. It's, it's just don't get it. It's not terrible, but honestly, if it was my size, it would fit me 10 times better and I would love it so much more, so. Just a little side note there. All right guys, so we have one more piece to show you guys. This is one of my favorite pieces, but this piece is the most complicated to put on and is annoying. <laughs> it's honestly so annoying, but I love it. All right, so this is what it looks like here. Yeah, you're looking at it like what is going on? That's what I said when I initially took it out the bag, like what is going on? But again, it's that whole crisscross in the front type moment. It gives me red Power Ranger. That is the vibes that I get from this. I put it on and I'm like, I am a red Power Ranger. It also came with sleeves attached to it, but again, I like to play DIY Barbie and I DIY'd it. Cut the sleeves off because it was just feeling way too restricting with like how complicated it was to put on and then the sleeves and I was just like, you know what, this is gonna suffocate me and I will die. So I decided to just cut the sleeves off so now I can just slip them on without feeling like everything is just like stuck together. You know what I mean? Like, do you guys get what I'm saying? You know those outfits where you're like, okay, too much is going on here. We need to release some of this. Yeah, that was this outfit. All right guys, so that is all the pieces that I got from Pretty Little Thing and I'm absolutely obsessed with majority of them. There's some that are a little bit mm, but besides that, I love it, like so cute, so many like stylish pieces. If you guys did get this far in the video, let me know down below which piece you think was the best out of all of them. And also don't forget to follow me on social media, especially Instagram, guys. That's where I post a lot of content. I'm constantly on Instagram, I'm constantly posting. If you wanna stay updated on what I'm doing in my life, that is the place to be because trust me, my stories are always they're always popping. <laughs> but anyways, with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did like it, please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel down below and click that little bell button so you're notified every time I post a video. All the links to my social medias are listed down below, so check me out on there. I love you guys so much, and I'll talk to you in my next video.
Bye. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. There must be something bad for